In today's How To Tuesday, I'm going to be talking about our Timco Multifix Resin Heavy Duty Anchoring System. What it is, how to use it, and giving you a few quick tips on getting the best possible fixing. The range offers an effective fixing into concrete and masonry. The stress-free aspect of this solution gives greater flexibility when anchoring closer to a substrate edge such as a balustrade installation. The permanent nature of the system means that the fixings cannot be removed, but gives a higher load capacity compared to expanding sleeve anchors. We offer three variants, all of which carry an ETA approval. An economic polyester resin, ideal for day-to-day non-safety critical applications, a styrene free low odour polyester resin, ideal for day to day applications in areas with low ventilation, and a high performance vinyl ester styrene free resin. Our VESF resin is also a low odour product for use in safety critical applications. It can be used in enclosed, polyventilated, damp, and wet environments and offers consistent high tensile strength. It is also a RAS approved material. Each cartridge is supplied with an essential T-flow nozzle, which has been designed to improve the mixing of the product and reduce wastage. And when used with our professional non-drip resin gun, gives a fantastic low extrusion force. There are several simple steps to installation. Drill the correct size hole into the masonry. To allow room for the right amount of resin, we recommend drilling the hole 2mm larger than the fixing up to 16mm and 4mm larger than the 20mm fixing. In order to guarantee a secure fixing, it is crucial that any debris is cleaned from the hole. We stock a variety of hole cleaning brushes and a blowout pump to help. Repeat the process two to four times until the hole is clean. After fitting the nozzle, extrude five centimeters of unmixed resin to waste. Then pump the resin to fill two thirds of the hole. Now insert the fixing by slowly rotating into the hole, allowing the resin to mix into the threads. Be careful not to get any resin on the threads of the fixing, as it may prevent attaching a nut onto it later. Here, I'm using a threaded bar into the concrete, but we also stock a range of chemical anchor studs, which have an embedment mark to guide you. Our chemical studs are available in both zinc plated and galvanized. All come complete with a nut and washer. Finally, Leave the fixing to cure for the time stated on the side of the cartridge prior to adding any load to the fixing. Once cured, a washer and nut can be added to secure a fixing into place. We sell spare T-flow nozzles due to the curing of resin inside them so they can't be reused. The benefit of this is when using a small amount of resin, the remainder of the cartridge is not wasted. Simply screw the old nozzle off and attach the new one. The versatility and flexibility of the Timco Multifix resin can solve many problems as well as anchoring into concrete and masonry. To check suitability when using it for something else, please contact us further assistance. If fixing into hollow block, we offer plastic sleeves to aid installation, M8 and M10 bolts and threaded bars. We also reduce wastage of resin inside the block cavity. We'll click below to download our technical data sheets for the range. A new addition to the range is the resin accessory case. The kit contains all the required accessories complete a safe and efficient chemical anchor fixing. 
just add the required resin. Ideal when on site to keep your cartridges and ancillaries safe and in one place. See our website for a list of approximate gel and load times, minimum embedment depths and approximate holes per cartridge. We'll click below to download our technical data sheets for the range. So there you have it, much simpler than it appears. See you next week for another How To Tuesday.